everything you wanted to know about RV systems on a flash drive. Yes. Oh, hell. hello, Lens. How are you? And you have a very fuzzy company on top of you. That does not, ooh, that did not sound right. <laughs> this is a family show. All right, so we got the shell off. I've got the axles ordered. We're setting off the frame to have it repaired a little bit. I've got to completely redo the plumbing. But you know what? I've done faucets before. I've got this. Hey, you're gonna need some training. Electrical. I mean, come on, I've done outlets. I've done light bulbs. I've even put in ceiling fans. I've got this. Uh, you're gonna need some training. Propane. Where the heck does the propane go? Propane. <laughs> Let's go get some training. All right, so we got our uh, flash drive in and our materials from RV Tech Course. Uh, six different modules going over the information of the RV from electrical uh, to plumbing uh, to uh, LP systems to major appliances to the exterior. Everything that you need to know about an RV all in one flash drive. Yeah, it's pretty cool actually. You just put it in your computer like this and you can open it up and start watching the videos. They correspond with the workbook, so you just follow it in order. So the program was really designed for consumers, RVers like yourselves, um, wanting to know more about how to troubleshoot their own issues and uh, service a lot of their own maintenance problems. So in the box that you get in the mail, um, you're gonna have your flash drive with all your videos and they go along with six different workbooks. Um, workbook one and workbook two are on electrical. Uh, workbook three is on propane and water system. Workbook four is air conditioners and refrigerators. Workbook five is water heaters and furnaces. And then workbook six is on the exterior of the unit, like slide out systems. Terry Cooper has been awesome at designing this, uh, laying it out very easy for the normal person to understand. You don't have to already be a techie or have tons of experience with maintenance to understand the class. It's definitely gonna help us out. So it's not designed for a total rebuild like what we're doing, but it definitely gives us the concepts uh, between 12 volt systems, 120 volt systems, uh, LP systems, what, you know, the, um, what the pressure is supposed to be gives us an opportunity to study up while we're waiting for our axles to come in. If you want more information on how to get a course like this, you can just visit rvtechcourse.com and we'll also link the information in the description of this video. All right, so as we're studying this, what we're doing this week is we're taking the girls out to Scarborough Fair. Uh, it's a renaissance festival uh, where everyone dresses up in old English uh, outfits. Use it. You know what's really cool? Sword fighting. You never outgrow the urge to beat on your friends with padded weapons and it's free over here. And uh, assumes the character. It's off to college week. They're hitting the books to win a million bucks. This week on Millionaire with new host Chris Harrison. Right now it's back to college week. You know, for us, it's a, it's a wonderful opportunity to people watch. I'm sure. Oh boy, it might be a little bit of an education opportunity for my children. We'll see jousting. Various other things that we'll see. <laughs> but they're unexplainable. Come join us. About to leave. Already packing, come with me. I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action, what we can be. Life with no distractions. We'll get away. This is what we waited for.
cool shows that we've enjoyed, but uh, we kind of get into them at the last second, you know, or we miss most of it. So we want to come back for sure. It's definitely a people watching opportunity, though. You know, see a lot true. of strange things here. Yeah, I, think, I feel like we just kind of scratched the surface of the craziness you can see. We'll make it somehow. We'll